fox is being a butt. But, 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 but. Ugh. Aha! My dearest Lynette, I was injured on the way back from the Conclave when this insane war erupted between the Apostates and the Templars. I made it to a decrepit inn just before the gash on my leg turned into a fever. Fortunately, when the Inquisition's people found me, they sent for a proper healer. I owe them my life, I'm certain. I'm told the Inquisition will deliver this letter to you, which is the first peace of mind I've had since the Conclave. Stay in the capital, my love, until I can come to you. Yours always, Ellerly. Need more power? <laughs> I don't think so. I think that's a lot of power already. Whoops. So Josephine's mission requires a lot of war table time. So now I gotta go to Valroyal. Valroyal. I really... Mm, I went to that temple... Uh, I don't know. That's a lot, this. Too many, too many. Cullen? Oh, I've got ways. I'm sure Evelyn has enough power for Cullen to get Cullen's attention. The blonde elf of the Inquisition. Didn't I see you with her once? Oh. Hi. Sorry about that. Brought her and her friends information. You're a mage, not my patron. I've no reason to be polite to you. Your patron is my patron. You must admit that new leadership would be refreshing. I admit nothing of the sort. Empress Celine like is an a fine leader. Pleasure. You only say so much because I've been long long your own game unscathed. Might there be what any other news from I this do? house? That is all lay. Here's a letter from Ellery. He's safe with his family in the dales. Oh, my Ellery. Oh, bless you. The Dions will sponsor the two paraquets as a family deserving of a noble title, Inquisitor. You have my word. Now, please forgive my hastiness, but I must read Ellery's words. Make her keep you. No, Bess, no. No, Bess, no. So what are you up to? Sorry, my uh... I think my capture device was giving some trouble, so I apologize for that. <laughs> I'm tired, but I want to play, you know? Not tired to sleep, just tired from work. But I felt like playing. I always feel like playing. Inquisitor? <gasps> Inquisitor! What happened here? The House of Repose decided to pay a visit. The guards arrived in time, but I should have guessed the assassins would infiltrate the servants. Are you sure they didn't hurt you? They only frightened me. It was all so sudden. Leliana assigned people to shadow me. 
They appear to have saved my life. I owe you everything, Sergeant. Only my duty, Ambassador. I'll talk with the spy master about these murderous louts. She'll find how they got in. Deciding between Far Cry or Dragon Age? Uh, Dragon Age? Any news on the House of Repose, Inquisitor? That may just be my bias speaking, but, uh, Dragon Age? Uh, ouchie. What's the next favor we need to get these Duparakats a lordship? We need a judge of the royal court to procure documents acknowledging them as nobility again. How dare you, scum. Nobody attacks Josephine and gets away with it. That's why you're dead. Seriously, don't. My last Dragon Age novel came in to the bookstore a couple days ago, and I didn't get the email until today. So I'm gonna go pick up that tomorrow. Yay! Random, but I'm excited, so I wanted to share. So I can finally start reading the books now that I have the order because that's the one that I needed to start reading and I couldn't read it because I didn't have it and I had all the other books and it wasn't in order and yada 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 getting a judge's favor inquisitor we must have an Orlesian judge sign papers formally requesting we elevate the Duke Paraquets into nobility I have approached judge Ald who has requested a party of inquisition soldiers meet him in the frostbacks for a hunting expedition some sort of rare spider as big as a horse. Ugh. The judge was telling me what the judge was telling me lives inside the caves a few days west of Skyhold, oh, I see. He would like an honor guard who knows the mountains to show him the way. Send me some scouts and officers to accompany him, and Judge Ald will happily sign the paperwork we require. Josephine. The commander has kindly found some soldiers he can spare to accompany Judge Ald's hunting party. Inquisitor? I still say Dragon Age, but <laughs> it, it ultimately is up to you. Oh man, Tales of Zesty Burrito soon. I can't wait, seriously. I don't know why I left, because I don't think there's anything else I can do right now. It's just Josephine's mission. Until I can do those others in the western approach, so it's better to wait for those. So then we can do Hawk's mission too. Oops. Oh no, it's not on this side. Uh, no, I didn't mean to close it. Uh, a zesty breakfast burrito. Hinata Muchacha would like a burrito. He probably would. Good old... Good old... What? Good old... Kind of stuffy. Good old Hinata Latte con tomate. Hinata Muchacha. Yo yo. Oh, you and your puns. <laughs> Inquisitor, Judge Ald has signed the papers we need to present the Duparakets as nobility again. There is now only one step left. A royal minister must ratify them. Please come see me when you have a chance. The judge passes on his compliments, by the way. Apparently the hunt was a marvelous bit of sport, and our soldiers acquitted themselves bravely against something called a screaming man-eater. The infirmary reassures me the injured will make a full recovery. Josephine. Oh, what's this? 
Inquisitor, we are honored to serve the Inquisition and we will leave straight away. I pray that you defeat Corypheus, whatever he is, soon. It is terrifying to see demons pour into the world, endangering in innocent people. And as a medium, I have studied spirits at, spirits? Really? Spirits at length. I know many of these poor creatures meant no harm to this world and were drawn into it against their will, corrupted through no fault of their own into something dangerous. I once called such a creature my friend. I lost him in the rebellion and never had the chance to offer forgiveness for the mistakes he made or help him find his way back safely into the Fade. For the sake of both this world and that of the spirits, I wish you success. Both Evangeline and I will fight tirelessly on your behalf. Yours, uh, is it Rice or Reese? I can't remember. Uh, there's a note below, presum presumably added by Cole. He remembers. He remembered you, Cole. Mondo James Bondo? Oh my god. Mondo James Bond. Oh no! Why did I do that? Uh, I'm not thinking right now. I'm sorry. I meant to go to Josephine. Cole slightly approves of me entering and exiting the war room. Any news on the House of Repose, Inquisitor? What's the next favor we need to get these duparacats a lordship? We must persuade the Minister Belize to ratify the papers. She's in charge Oh, I know who you're Marquis talking Park. about. The Minister will be at a small fete thrown by the Marquis Wiscott. I'll get you an invitation. This is a butt. Don't spoil anything. Musicals playing Mass Effect for the first time. So don't spoil anything. Oh, nice. So you can search while you're in game. Pretty sweet. Which side is the side on the side? This side. Ambassador Montelier, forgive the late reply. Wonderful as it is to hear from you. I've just ridden from trouble in the Dales. The civil war has made man managing my holdings even more difficult. Sorry, I'm like... It would be much easier if I had the ear of the Council of Heralds, but alas, fortune has left me poor in that regard. The Inquisitor is always welcome at one of my humble fets. I only regret that it may not be as grand as I would like. Please, dear lady, promise me you will warn her worship that my preoccupation will pre preclude a richer evening with my guests. With deep regard, Marquis Wiscott. Is it Marquis, I think? I don't know. Marquis. Je suis baguette. Let us begin. That's what you're calling your Twitch broadcast? <gasps> Are you doing that right now? No way, right? Sometimes I feel really bad because sometimes I want to watch other people stream certain things. Uh, but then I want to play stuff that I have to record and then I end up, that's why I end up having to stream. Because I record this stuff. I might not do that as often though, by the way. I might not upload everything I stream to, uh, to YouTube. I think I'll leave it as a, let me know if you want me to upload this. If not, I think it's much easier for me to just play games on stream and not have to worry about uploading them. But if it's requested, I will. I don't know. That's how I feel anyway. Oh. 
I came back here and I need to advance time. Great. Good job, me. Oh, you didn't have to do that, musical. Thank you, but you didn't have to. Oh, you were? What is a good stopping point? Because I just plow through those games. <laughs> to be quite honest. I'm sorry if I keep yawning. I had to work today and I was up early, so... Inquisitor, I have the time and place of the Marquis party. You must find... <laughs> Derp. You must find a way to speak with Minister Belize privately about ratifying the Duke Barraquette's return to norm no normal. Return to normal. Return to nobility. It is the last step we need. She holds the success of this entire endeavor in her hands. Josephine. Okay, Josephine. Oh yeah, for sure highlights. Highlights will always be a thing that I will upload, but I meant like certain... Like, let's say I'm playing... Well, I'm already thinking when I replay Mass Effect. I already have Mass Effect as a silent playthrough on my YouTube. So I might just do highlights for that. If there are any. And then, I don't know. Because my YouTube videos don't get a lot of attention anyways. Not that I expect them to, because I don't really do much. I literally just cut the stream up into little pieces. And by little pieces, I mean hours long worth of why do I keep leaving when I can just teleport hours long worth of stuff so you know oh Liara Liara aka Scout Harding I don't have a drink and I'm sad because I don't have a drink. I miss Alistair. Ah! You read my thing! Thank you for seeing me in private, Minister Belize. I chastise you for taking me from the party, Inquisitor, but the Marquis throws such dull affairs, it's hardly worth it. <laughs> I assume you wish to discuss your petition to elevate these du paraquettes to a minor lordship. Tell me, why should I allow you to pollute the Orlesian nobility any further than it's already been muddled? The Duparakets used to be noble. You'd be restoring an old house of Orlais. <laughs> restoring yep, same voice actor. late. What are the Duparakets now? Traders? Farmers? Really, it is too much. The very thought causes me pain. What can you possibly provide that will make your petition worth my effort? Yeah, the thing that I wrote. You read it. <laughs> or at least you liked it. Wait, is it's a mask? Look at this. <laughs> Information. Unless you believe your sources better than agents of the Inquisition. Normally, I wouldn't trust your discretion. But the left hand of the Divine is working for you, is she not? Sister Leliana is a resourceful woman. I could certainly make use of her talents. Very well, Inquisitor. Should you fulfill this bargain, I shall... raise the Duparaquettes into Lordship. Thank you. 
Sometimes I just have feels and I have to write them down. So that's what that was. It's a mask, Biss. Are you okay? <laughs> I write lots of things. I just don't share them. With you. Inquisitive. Or other people I tend to know. Hey, you are no. <laughs> you are no. I must return to the Palace Oaks to see that on everything is not. The last inheritance is discovered, and Tope is not a spring cut. You shut your mouth when Josephine's talking. Their best state room. The it's good to see you. <laughs> that was a lot of talking all at once. I didn't understand a word. Let's speak later. Another time. It's good to see. Oh wait, it says it says meet. Let's speak later. It says meet Josephine. Right back to Val Royou. You're not brave enough to share your feels. Why? Well, I mean, no one really... I don't know. It's not that big a deal seeing as only like three or so people end up reading those anyways. I mostly just write them and then tag them so I can find them later. Hey Biss, you're no. You are no. Emperor Florian. Josie. I received a letter from the House of Repose, Your Worship. They acknowledge their contract is null and void. There is no longer a price on my life. They also send their compliments on how handily you dispatched their agent pretending to be the Comte. I'm glad you don't have to live your life looking over your shoulder anymore. I regret we were forced to deal with them, that you are endangered by my part in the game. Did I ever mention I used to be a bard? You were a singer? Bards entertain the Orlesian court. They sing, play music, make charming conversation, and spy. Many young nobles put on a mask and practice playing the game in such a fashion. What made you interested in becoming a bard? I was attending a university in Valroyo when I learned about bards. There was such an air of romance about them. Stories of secrets, trysts, and fascinating people. A group of us, young gentry from Antiva, decided this exciting life was for us. You seem oh, a did bit you? steady for such an outgoing lifestyle. <laughs> the life of an entertainer didn't suit me at all. During one particular intrigue, I encountered a bard sent to kill my patron. We fought. Or perhaps scrapped is the better word. Both of us terrified. We were at the top of a steep flight of stairs. The other bald threw a knife and I pushed him away from me. You can imagine the result. You were only defending yourself. But it was such a waste, Inquisitor. 
when I took off his mask, I knew him. We'd attended parties together. If I'd stopped to reason, if I'd used my voice instead of scuffling like a common thug, I'll always wonder who that young man would have grown into. He seemed willing enough to murder you for the game. Perhaps. I feel I'm the last to judge whether or not he would have actually used the blade. In all the commotion... Uh, forgive me, I don't believe I ever thanked you for helping me with this. Hold on to it. Don't lose sight of why you came here. I will never forget you helped save the House of Montillier, Inquisitor. And should you ever visit Antiva, stories of the welcome we'll give you will be told for years. Aww. Josie's adorable. Okay. Western approach time. So I was in the middle of stuff, and then thing happened, and then stuff. Okay. I did that. So... Let me go here. I'm still wondering when I unlock decor. Look! To Earl Tigan! <laughs> That'd be cute. Wait, Biss, what? I want to go this way. I want to unlock those things. Digan! Who is this woman, Digan? He's old for Dragon Age 4, please. He's old for one of the Inquisition DLCs, please. Please. We must keep the tradition of who is this woman, Digan? Please. It's imperative. Your worship. Oh, the water. I hope you have collision detection in volume physics. A. Look at that piece of shit down there. What is he doing? What are you doing, piece of shit? Whoa. No, I don't want to fight you. Why must you do this? Why? Good job, Cassandra. Make it take you. Just to say that line, yeah. I mean, she could also be there for reasons, but I just need her to say it. Who is this woman to get? Oh, but I just noticed. Yeah, swooping is bad needs to make a return, too. Swooping is bad. <laughs> Lovely. Oh, right, I don't think I can go very far because of that stupid thing. And I'm scared for my warden. I want her to return to her king. I don't think we can go this way. Can we? Can we? Can we? Old prison road. <gasps> Look how dangerous that... Ugh. Ugh. Okay. What is that? Watch out. Aww. No, war 
Jordan, no. Punch! No! He is, and he will be for a while. Oh, Varric, stop! Too good, too good. Ah, okay. See, I'm guessing that's the path my... Well, my warden wasn't a mage, but... I'm guessing she had a change of heart. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh man. Why, uh, why? Why am I stuck? No. Ugh. But I'm confused, because why... Where, when, why, how, you know? I need something to drink. I need something to drink. Piss off! Like that. Not so fun anymore, is it? So, Cassandra, where do I go? <coughs> Maybe not. I should probably head there then. I think that's where Hawk is. Maybe, maybe that's what happened. Whoops. Thinking about Cullen. And Alistair, for that matter. Thinking about the husbands. Ready? Ready? Boom! I seriously love that move. I'll kill you all! Oh, Hawk's not even here. Hawk is somewhere else. It's okay, we're still gonna take this place. Give me this keep. is mine. Shall we knock? Gladly. Oh shit. So much for knocking. 
Where are you going? Get back here. Sounded like a smoker's cough. Whoops. She would never. But I know what you mean. That was a pretty serious cough. Follow Varric and Cassandra. We Get away from me. <laughs> Rude. Attack Dorian. Ow, Dorian. Beep, beep. What is this keep again? Oh wait, 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 I really want to punch you off of there. Yes! <laughs> that brought me more joy than it should have. <laughs> I'm so happy. Is there a dude up here? What are you doing, buddy? Zap all the things. Is it ours yet? Is it ours? I'm level 17. Sweet! Flippin' sweet. Oh, there's a dude up there. Oh, there's a dude down here. How long can they keep this up? Hello? Not long enough. Hello? Here, Inquisitor! I am ready to serve! Oh, are you? Bitch. <laughs> This move so much. <laughs> it would have been better to push him down the stairs, but it's okay. Highlight? <laughs> Possibly. Oh, I'm being shot at. Okay. Boom. Rude! Don't touch my wife. Life is nothing. He will rage. Oh, piss off. Oh, that guy went flying in a weird way. Inquisitor, you want your very own fort in the middle of nowhere? Yes. It has water and a good tactical location. Dorian, you got a thing. Dorian got the thing. Whoopsie. Where did you go? Wow, Dorian. I could teach you some more of these spells, maybe. Or... Despair. Wait, is there more? Probably. Aw, Evelyn! Your face! Okay, nobody else is leveled up. Uh, 
I got a thingy. Whoa, cause <laughs> oh, it was Dorian that ran up. Dorian's like really happy that we captured this place. I think that's for taking over three keeps. Come on, just answer the question, Varric. My mother didn't raise any morons, Sparkler. I won't touch that one. You must have an opinion. And you're a dwarf, completely unbiased. There's no way I'm answering which Inquisition mage is the best dressed. Me! Not for all the golden Orsamar. I am. The answer is me. Oh, is it a fight between me and you, Dorian? I love how they started the banter in the middle of flipping a cutscene. Inquisitor. Hello. What's wrong with the water supply? The fort's well is full of garbage. Blasted venatori threw corpses in there. Rude. There's an oasis nearby, but a Vargas claimed it. Doing a decent job of keeping us away too. Four soldiers have already fallen to venom and claws. We'll need reinforcements to drive the monster out. What can you tell me about the darkspawn in the area? Viv probably the thinks it's her. True. Since we took the keep. I've warned the troops not to engage unless absolutely necessary. We don't need a blight in the ranks. We have to find whatever hole the monsters came from and seal it. Go, Dorian the Explorian! Report, Captain. What's the situation in the Western Approach? I've had scouts investigate that Red Lyrium operation you smashed. I don't think anyone's getting into that cave anytime soon. We haven't met, have we? What's your name, soldier? Where have you served? I beg your pardon, Inquisitor. Knight Captain Rylan at your service. Hmm. I served with the Templars in Starkhaven until they all ran off to the hill. Oh, you know Sebastian. <laughs> Commander Cullen offered me a job. <gasps> I was glad to do anything to help stop all this madness. Isn't he a great guy? Let's talk about how great he is. If you were in Starkhaven, how do you know Cullen? After Kirkwall exploded, Starkhaven sent aid. Rubble fell on much of the city. A lot of people were homeless or trapped in collapsed buildings. I coordinated rescue efforts. And met Cullen while he was trying to command what was left of Kirkwall's Templars. Isn't he great? He's amazing, isn't he? He's wonderful. How is the Inquisition treating you so far, Captain? It's good work. Some of it's a touch batty. But I'm always glad to be doing something useful, Inquisitor. There's no shortage of things that need repaired, shored up, or just a good bucket of water dumped on them. Carry on, Captain. Yes, Inquisitor. Hi, Dorian. You're not Knight Captain Ryland, Dorian. What are you doing? <laughs> um, so we got to do the water thing. can't help it. The trouble with dark spawn. Okay, let's do it. Where's Cullen? <laughs> Inquisitor. Let's do it. What? I said nothing. I said let's do it and then I thought of Cullen. How bad is that? Do so bad. Bootstraps out of your teeth. Shit. Don't mind me, sir. This is a very secure line of soldiers you got here. I can't even climb them. I guess I'll go around. <laughs> you ever notice how many casualties there are on our patrol? Dirk's burn.
I've got everything you need for a quiet kill, Inquisitor. Do you now? No Come on, friends. Run! Beric! <laughs> Beric can fit under it just now. Okay, friends, watch out. Sandra, no, I'm closing the doors. Move. Good. What? I'm here. Where the Dirks burn? Where? Here, let me look for an operations thing. Unless this is it. What is this? Aha! It's no use! We can't cross here! The dog spawn got through. <coughs> I'll have to see what our people at Skyhold can do. Make it take you to Disneyland. That was a terrible joke. Was it even a joke? I didn't even mean it as a joke. I just said make her take you to Disneyland. Okay, so I guess we have to go back to Skyhold really quick and then come back. Seriously, I wish there was a way that Alistair was in the game more. I know he is when he's a Grey Warden, but when he's a king, I wish also that he would make an appearance more. Mm -hmm. I want to hear, after I get um, further in the romance, I want to hear what the NPCs have to say. Some of those gossiping nobles say some funny things. I heard of a particularly lewd one, and I'm like, whoa. I need to see if that's real. Because that's hilarious. What is this? Gather metals. Have you had any trouble with them? Not at all. I will inform you if that changes. All that glitters is gold! Whoa, musical! You're a turbo member all of a sudden! What happened? The Griffin Wing outpost has some access to water, but not enough to sustain the number of people there for a significant amount of time. The situation is not desperate, but if we were to maintain a presence in the western approach, the outpost will require access to fresh water. We should locate a reliable source as soon as possible. A few scouts could search for a water source. A few scouts should search the western approach for a reliable water source. This should be a high priority. A group of soldiers can be sent to locate and secure a water source for the outpost. Sure, why not? All right. Hmm. Things? What do you mean? Your chat isn't showing up. I can see what you type. Commander, our work continues in the approach. It's a difficult post, but our soldiers are determined to represent the Inquisition as best they can. Morale flags at times, but we manage. But we manage. <laughs> Simple comforts, I can read, can go a long way. <laughs> and rations don't lift a soldier's spirits. We can see that they have a good meal at the end of the day. I agree. Fitted with proper shoes. 
Perhaps a distraction would help. We can see about sending books. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with Cullen on that one, too. Inquisitor, we've received reports of an abandoned gold mine in the hills south of Griffin Wing Keep. According to the locals, the mine is still capable of producing. It was abandoned only because the threat of Darkspawn attack... Of Darkspawn attack? Made the operation unfeasible. Should we dispatch soldiers to secure the place and guard any wagon that make their way to the keep, it should add considerably to our income for the future. Cullen. Commander Cullen, we've scattered reports of... Sorry, we have scattered reports of Darkspawn in the area, but it has been difficult to track down their point of origin. They're less hampered by the sulfur pits than we are, and our guess is that they're coming from somewhere on the far side. Our troops can bridge the pits, should allow, should, which should, oh my god, allow us to cross safely and find the location of the Darkspawn, but we will need significant resources to ensure the safety of the men while construction is underway. <gasps> I await your orders, sir, Lieutenant Thompson. Build a bridge. Books are good too, yes. Words are good. I know books are good, but... I don't know. Isn't a good meal good too? Commander Cullen, thanks to the reinforcements you sent, we constructed the bridge safely with minimal losses and fortified it in the evidence that Darkspawn tried to use it themselves. The Darkspawn are coming from ruins that appear to be to Vinter. Per your orders, I'm restricting the troops to scouting and guard patrols until the ruins can be investigated. We're not going yet, though. Simple comforts can go a long way. Rations don't lift a soldier's spirits. We can see that they have a good meal. A good meal is important. Inquisitor, our soldiers in the Western Approach located a suitable freshwater source. They faced some resistance from a particularly aggressive wyvern, but were able to subdue the threat and secure the area. I'm told that Lieutenant Kor in particular should be commended for his quick response, commended. As you can imagine, their success has raised morale among our followers in the Western Approach. To work? Commander, the situation is improving here at Griffin Wing. Water source is secured and most things are under control. However, our activities in the desert have destroyed some Vargas nests, which has riled them up and desperate. Now they are attacking caravans, I can read, on the main road, scavenging from our provisions. Makes it hard to get supplies in for so sure, sure, so sure. Any advice? The Vargas situation is partly our fault. We took their water, their habitat. Our veteran rangers could try to lead the Vargas to a better place where they can establish themselves. Hunt and kill. Nah, Liliana. Let's see what we have. Let's lead them to a new place. To a whole new world. What's a plain plushie? A clever idea in theory. We lost soldiers to sandstorms and yawning pits of death, but the local wildlife is safe and that's what's important, right? Well, that sucks. Commander, everyone's grateful for the new cook. A good meal after a long day certainly lifts the spirits. Talk around the dinner table has become more lively. Supplies in the approach are limited, but I swear that man can cook anything from nothing. One night he managed to produce fish and egg pie. I hadn't had one of those since Starkhaven. Sometimes the smallest things remind you what you're fighting to protect. Aww. All that glitters is gold. Inquisitor. Okay, I guess we can head back now, right? Uses gorilla glue. What? And glue. What? Glue the mustache pin to your face. I'm confused. 
I need to get a drink, so I guess I will be right back. Whoa, that stuff scared me. Be right back as quick as I can. What are you guys talking about? Oh, you want to get something in? You've driven me to drink. <laughs> My cat's here. Assuming anyone's still here and you haven't all gone for a drink. Ah, stupid. Sorry, one second. My kitty is here. My kitty says meow. Ran out of soda. Wonder what kind of soda. I want soda. <laughs> 